When the Red Sox signed outfielder Masataka Yoshida to a five-year, $90 million contract, it was considered the largest contract ever given to a position player coming to the United States from Japan. Yes, that was more money than the Mariners gave Ichiro Suzuki in 2000. More than the Yankees gave Hideki Matsui in 2002. More than Shohei Otani earned in 17. And a little more than the $85 million Seiya Suzuki received last year. But guys, before we continue with this news, leave your like and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any news from the Sox. Now without further ado, let's get to the Sox video. Some of that, of course, is due to inflation. But much of it is due to the growing confidence teams are gaining in their ability to properly analyze how well a Japanese player can acclimate to MLB. Make no mistake, there is still an element of risk that the Red Sox are taking here, because you never know how a player will do in MLB until how he gets there. In fact, the scouting and evaluating population seems very confused on what Yoshida has to offer. But the Red Sox have researched and followed him for several years and are confident in their assessment of the type of player he can be. Why do the Red Sox think this will work? For starters, his contact rate was at an elite level in NPB. So was his on-base percentage. But you need to go beyond the numbers when analyzing how a player's skill set will translate from Japan to MLB. Here's a sampling of different voices on how Yoshida can succeed in MLB. Red Sox baseball director Heim Bloom, we watched Masataka for a while. For us, what really stood out from every angle from a watching angle, from breaking down the performance, is just the quality of the hitting. There's a unique combination of contact skills and discipline in the strike zone and the ability to impact baseball that we feel has a chance to really impact the game at the major league level. Agent Scott Boris, who represents Yoshida, teams aren't bringing a Japanese position player here unless he has extraordinary power or is a great hitter with power. This is a great hitter with power. We think he will have success here because his swing plane at the top of the zone is a flat bat. He has the ability to hit for power without a big swing. His eyes and control of the strike zone are there. We know from watching him hit at speed that he's very good at it. We think the transition will be very, very good. I think those are the strongest components that Boston felt, as well, about him. Red Sox hitting coach Pete Fats, I think the most impactful thing is the ability to hit for speed. Also, the contact rate. The ability to hit for power, but always be in control. In leverage counts, he can make aggressive, controlled hits and do a lot of damage, and he has the ability to back off and use the whole field, going the other way. 